Hello there, wonderful people. Today, I've got a treat for you all. We're diving headfirst into the wild world of overloaded transportation. But before we embark on that adventure, let's take a moment to appreciate those folks with Herculean strength. Seriously, they're like real-life superheroes without the capes. So, buckle up, if you can find space amidst the cargo, and let's get this comedic convoy rolling. These bags of rice weigh about 50 kilograms, so can you carry them? Alrighty, folks, get ready to witness some two-wheeled feats of epic proportions. Today, we're diving into the wacky world of motorcycle carrying capacity. First up, we've got motorcycles hauling around coconut tree trunks. I mean, talk about some serious balancing skills. It's like they're auditioning for the circus on wheels, and check out these daredevils maneuvering through traffic with rice stalks strapped to their bikes. It's like watching a real-life game of, how much can you fit on a motorcycle? These riders deserve a round of applause for their top-notch motorcycle juggling skills. Who needs a pickup truck when you've got a motorcycle and nerves of steel, am I right? Now, hold on to your hats, folks, because we're about to witness some serious moving power. Feast your eyes on these carts being pulled by none other than our adorable bovine buddies. Yep, you heard that right, cows on a mission, I've got to hand it to these lovable creatures, they're not just about grazing and chilling in the fields. Oh no, they're here to show off their muscles and their work ethic. But hey, let's be real for a sec, while they might be strong, they're not exactly known for their soft landings. So, let's hope those carts have some serious shock absorbers because these cows aren't messing around. Alrighty, buckle up, folks, because we're about to board the, whoa, that's way too many people, express. That's right, we're diving headfirst into the world of overloaded passenger trains. I mean, seriously, how do they even fit that many people in there? It's like a game of human Tetris, but with way higher stakes, now, I'm no expert, but I'm pretty sure safety regulations weren't exactly a top priority when they designed these trains. But hey, who needs personal space when you can cozy up to your fellow commuters, right? It's like a bonding experience you never asked for, so, what's my take on it? Well, let's just say I'm all for efficiency, but maybe let's leave the sardinekin style transportation to the actual sardines, shall we? Hold on to your hats, folks, because we're about to venture into the world of farm vehicles that defy all laws of physics. Feast your eyes on these beasts of burden carrying an absolute mountain of cargo. I mean, who knew tractors could moonlight as freight trains, am I right? Now, I haven't personally tested out this mode of transportation, but I imagine it's a bit like riding a roller coaster through a tornado, thrilling, terrifying, and probably not recommended by any reputable safety board, but hey, if you've ever dreamed of experiencing what it's like to be a human fly on the wall of a cargo-packed farm vehicle, now's your chance. Just remember to bring a parachute, or at least a strong stomach. Alrighty, folks, get ready to witness some trucking antics that'll have you on the edge of your seat, or maybe even hiding behind it. We're talking about trucks with cargo capacities that defy all logic and reason. Seriously, these behemoths look like they're one pothole away from a game of vehicular Jenga, but fear not, because behind the wheel of these overloaded beasts are none other than the daredevils of the road, professional truck drivers who navigate through traffic with the finesse of a bull in a china shop. I mean, who needs to worry about balance when you've got nerves of steel, right? So, buckle up, my friends, and let's tip our hats to these truckers who prove that when it comes to hauling the impossible, they're the true kings of the road, even if it means flirting with danger in the process. Hold on to your life vests, folks, because we're about to set sail into the realm of overcrowded ships. We're talking about vessels packed to the brim with more people than a clown car at a circus. It's like a floating fiesta, but with a slightly higher chance of seasickness, now, I'm not one to rock the boat, but let's address the elephant, or should I say, the whole circus troop, in the room. Are these ships safe? Well, let's just say if Titanic taught us anything, it's that cramming too many people onto a floating metal tub can lead to some rather soggy situations, but hey, who needs personal space when you've got ocean views, am I right? So, have I ever been on one of these overcrowded ships? Let's just say I prefer my cruises with a side of elbow room and a sprinkle of sanity. Alrighty, folks, we're diving headfirst into the world of overloaded trailers. These bad boys have more towing power than a team of oxen on Red Bull, I tell ya. We're talking about hauling volumes of products that'll make your jaw drop faster than a lead balloon, so, prepare to be amazed, bewildered, and possibly a little concerned for the structural integrity of these trailers. 
because when it comes to transporting goods, these vehicles don't mess around. It's like watching a heavyweight boxer bench press a mountain, impressive, slightly terrifying, and definitely not something you see every day, so, grab your popcorn and get ready to witness the ultimate test of towing prowess. Because when these trailers hit the road, you can bet your bottom dollar it's going to be a wild ride. Hold on to your steering wheels, folks, because we're about to take a joyride through the land of oversized cars. Get ready to witness drivers navigating these behemoths through the streets like they're playing a real-life game of, how low can you go, with traffic signs and tree branches, I mean, seriously, these cars are so big, they make SUVs look like Hot Wheels. It's like watching a circus clown trying to parallel park an elephant, you just can't look away, so, buckle up and prepare for some automotive acrobatics that'll have you saying, how did they even fit that thing on the road? Because when it comes to oversized cars, these drivers are about to show us some serious cartistic skills. Alright, hold on to your helmets, folks, because we're about to cruise through the urban jungle with the kings and queens of oversized cargo motorcycles. These riders are like modern day knights, bravely navigating through the chaos of the city streets with payloads that'll make your jaw drop faster than a dropped ice cream cone on a hot summer day, I mean, seriously, watching these riders weave through traffic with loads that seem more suited for a freight train is like witnessing a real life game of Tetris on wheels. It's a balancing act that would make even the most seasoned circus performer applaud, so, prepare to be amazed as we salute these urban daredevils who prove that when it comes to transporting oversized cargo, they're the true champions of the concrete jungle. Alrighty, folks, time for a little audience participation. Have you ever tried shipping something oversized? Maybe you've attempted to send a giraffe through the mail, we don't recommend it, or perhaps you've thought about mailing that giant inflatable T-Rex you won at the fair, whatever your oversized shipping shenanigans may be, we want to hear about it. Drop a comment below and let us know your tales of shipping adventures gone hilariously oversized. Who knows, maybe your story will inspire the next great shipping legend.